On this video, we're going to talk about how to register and set up with Glowhost. To be honest, this site is a little bit not so popular. The stats here show Glowhost are receiving an estimate of 20,000 visitors per month. So, what I guess is they probably wouldn't hire a lot of labels plus buying resources. What I assume is that you will get a standard quality hosting server. Maybe. This is what my review is about. I will split the topic into few sectors. On this video, I will put you on my shoulder guiding you how I register and set up a domain and hosting on Glowhost. So, you are given a few hosting options depending on your needs, but I want to test out the R share host to 5 if my five bug is well worth. First, we need to get a domain name. I found Glowhost provide free domain name no matter what hosting package you are about to buy. This applies on all different period of building cycle, in exceptions of one month with coupon code. Anyway, I'm using Namecheap, and I recommend them. They are the one of the best domain name registry provider I've been using for years. The reason being is, they offer free who is privacy. They secure your registered personal information from public. I don't really need the domain at the moment, so let's try out the cheapest options. Namecheap provide quite a number of cheap top level domain. One of it is .xyz domain extension. Let's try a random domain name to test glowhost.xyz. Proceed to check out if you haven't already registered an account with them, please do so. Quick support, competitive price, been with them since 2012. After the payment is made, you'll be redirected to the waiting page, which take a few minutes to load up. Back to Glowhost, hover crucial to hosting plan, then click share hosting. Scroll down a little, you will find 4 different hosting plans. There are 4 different share hosting options offered here. I don't find them very much different. The differences between unlimited and personal or professional is, according to their saying, unlimited is for storage users while personal and professionals are speed oriented. To keep this video short, I've included all features explanation on another video, including reviewing their site speed, latency speed, download speed, uptime and more. I've left the link on the description box. Be sure to check out if you are keen to purchase. I'm going to try out their personal hosting since this is what they boasted as best share web hosting. It's not my saying but it's highlighted on their site. See? But I can tell the support is very something. You'll receive a reply in a matter of minutes. Depending on the difficulty of your questions, I'm subscribing one month just for testing. Server locations is not a matter, but we could try something different here. Let's try Canada. Soon after you click order now, you are asked to register a new domain or enter your existing domain. Just a reminder, Glowhost offer free domain name no matter what hosting plan you purchase. But since I've already bought a domain on Namecheap, I will use that. Type in the domain name we have just registered on Namecheap on the right. A random domain name to test glowhost.xyz. On the bottom of the page, click have a promo code, type take 50 off and click apply. Wait a while, your card will be updated with a 50% off. You can also try the code glowhost personally provide me, ban 50 off, which is the same too. Here is a story. After the purchase is made, in about 12 minute times, I receive a support ticket opened by them. They asked if I was creating a review video for Glowhost. I said yes. They were very sharp for noticing that domain name I've attached on Glowhost. The add-ons are not very necessary, but if you want SEO service, I can recommend you a cheap source. Link on descriptions. Double check the domain name, the subscription periods, the promo code. If everything is fine, click continue. Enter your personal details. If you prefer not to, then enter partial of your information then. At least give them a name to address you. John Smith for example. Click continue to proceed to payment. Once payment is complete, we will receive an email from them which is our login access and hosting details. It's instant. That was pretty something. Okay, now open the email from Glowhost. They have all the hosting details in which are important. Make sure to pin it or save it elsewhere. 
do not delete this email will be given my glow C panel FTP login detail and two name server. Since we have access to our server now, we need to attach the domain from Namecheap. Log into Namecheap, navigate to the domain name we have just purchased, click manage, scroll down a little and click the drop down menu. Click custom DNS. Back to the email we have just received, copy and paste the name server on Namecheap, click the tick button to save it. Now, we will have to wait quite a while. Probably 5 minutes, probably an hour, probably a day for the domain name to complete the DNS propagations. Meanwhile, since we now have access to cPanel, let's create a homepage. Go back to the email we have just received from Glowhost, click the link below the word cPanel. Copy the login detail and login. Welcome to cPanel. There are a lot of programs and software to explain, but for now, click File Manager. Go to public underscore HTML, which is the directory of all files being published live on your site. Click the file index.html and click the edit button on the top. Type in any random text and click save. You should be able to see the page after the DNS propagation is completed. If you would like to install open source software like WordPress or PrestaShop, on cPanel, search Software Close Apps Installer. Here, load a list of software available to install in just a single click. We have done this topic for now. Make sure to check out my other videos reviewing Glowhost. I've left all the resources on the description box. Feel free to leave a comment if you have any question.